We're going to use a paper clip to illustrate some principles of materials behavior. If I take this paper clip and open it up, it's a little bit easier to illustrate this. If I hold this paper clip here and I add just a little bit of stress to the paper clip and then let go, it springs back. It's exhibiting elastic behavior. If I add it, this is because the atoms are sort of slipping just a little bit out of place. I apply the stress and then when I let go, atoms are sliding back into their original positions. If I add a lot more stress, I can see that I have deformed that paper clip permanently and now the material is exhibiting plastic behavior. This is because the atoms are moving out of their places and when I relieve the stress, they cannot slide back into their original positions. And so uh, when I wiggle the paper clip back and forth, Actually, it gets a little bit harder to, to move because every time I flex this paper clip, I'm adding more defects into that flexural point. And these defects make it harder for the metal to deform. But if I keep wiggling, eventually the material becomes, has, it gets so many defects in it that it sort of uh, gets harder to bend and uh, gets brittle to the point of failure. Okay, and this is an example of what we call uh, work hardening. And it got hard to the point where, and brittle to the point that it mechanically failed.